my name is Ashley Ron. I am the Youth Services Librarian here at the Egg Harbor Township branch of the Atlantic County Library System. One Thursday a month, I host a STEM Challenge Day for our local school age kids. Unfortunately, due to everything that's happening, we cannot have a physical program, but we can have a virtual one this month. And this is absolutely the perfect activity to do at home with anything you have lying around the house. We are actually going to do a really cool wrecking ball, and this is great, I would say, from ages 3 all the way up to 12. So, what I used here is two stacks of books. So if you have anything lying around like that, that would be great. You don't have to use books. You could use toilet paper tubes. You could use wood. You could use any kind of thing that can support a little bit of weight. So I use a ruler here in the middle and attached it to the two stacks of books, and I secured them with tape. And this is just you want to. This has just got to be something heavy enough to support some weight. And then you will need some kind of string or shoelace or twine. I use twine just to be able to secure the wrecking ball like um, item. Now I use some old tape but you could use um, a ball of some kind. You could use an apple, an orange, and you just want to make sure you're able to swing it back and forth. And the last thing you're going to want to have is some kind of thing that you can knock over. I use some markers so those would be fine if you have those lying around. Also you could try crayons, you could try any kind of bowling pins you have around. The kids could have a lot of fun doing different kinds of items here. It's really the most fun part of the project, I think. Now, what is cool is you can try all different materials, see what the results are with the same things or with different things. I would highly encourage you to track any results that you have, see what happens, plot it out. It could be a really fun science experiment. Now, the other thing too, you want to just try to use anything that you have around li lying around the house. You don't want to try to buy anything for this. It's really not necessary. So when you let go, you can see the result here that it knocks the item that you have lying around over. And what's neat is it will not actually come up higher than where you released it from. And that is definitely something you can point out to the kids. It's really cool. And please, any kind of pictures that you take while doing the activity of the item, of whatever you create, share them with us. Um, we are happy to look at anything you have. And we miss you guys, and we hope to see you soon.